King Charles and the Queen Consort wished people a happy Easter as they attended the first Easter Sunday service of the King's reign. The royal family was out in force in the grounds of Windsor Castle, enjoying the bright spring sunshine ahead of the morning service. Lots of photos of the royal family at church, Prince William and George at the footy yesterday. Today is a perfect opportunity to share fun family photos with young children. Easter egg hunt, visits with the Easter bunny and even going to church. Meghan doesn't usually miss an opportunity to try to upstage, so why so quiet? Maybe the rental kids were home with their own parents. Markle never joined the royal family for their Easter church outing. Meghan was just weeks away from marrying Prince Harry when the royals gathered at St George's Chapel in Windsor Castle for Easter in 2018. The engaged couple opted to skip the gathering, but Queen Elizabeth was joined for the service by Prince William. Catherine, who was pregnant with Prince Louis, who they'd welcome later that month. Easter fell on April the 21st, 2019, and Meghan missed the church outing as she was pregnant with the couple's first child. The royal family returned to their Easter church outing in 2022, with Prince George and Princess Charlotte making their debut at the event alongside their parents. Meanwhile, Prince Harry and Meghan stepped out on Easter to cheer on athletes at the Invictus Games in The Hague. In last year's Netflix docuseries, the Sussexes shared a home video from a previous egg hunt at their home. The clip shown in the six-part series sees Harry, Meghan and her mother, Doria, crafting an Easter egg hunt trail for Archie in their garden. At one moment in the clip, Harry can be seen placing a cardboard bunny in a flower bed in the garden. At the time of the footage, Meghan was pregnant with Lilibet, but it's thought that the young princess will join in on this year's celebrations. Archie and Lilibet seemingly won't play any part in the king's coronation, while Prince George will play a crucial part. Prince George will be a page of honour, while Princess Charlotte, Seven and Prince Louis, turns five next month, will join their grandfather and the queen as they leave the abbey. George will carry his grandfather's robes as he enters and leaves Westminster Abbey. The king and Prince William were eager for the young prince to play an important role on May the 6th, making him front and centre. George and seven other boys named Pages of Honour will attend their majesties, the king and queen consort, during the service. Their main role is to carry their long heavy robes. The honour is usually granted to teenage sons of members of the nobility and gentry, and especially of senior royal household members. Archie and Lilibet are both grandchildren of the new king, but despite this, it's believed that the three-year-old and one-year-old have not even been invited to the event, with sources saying that the children are very young. Harry and Meghan Markle have been invited to the coronation of King Charles and Queen Consort Camilla on May the 6th, despite stepping back from royal life. However, the Duke and Duchess are yet to confirm whether they'll be in attendance, and it is expected that they'll make a decision on the matter in a few days' time. Speaking on the pending coronation RSVP, a royal source told the Daily Beast, William is baffled by Harry not publicly saying that he's coming to the coronation, especially because everyone thinks that he'll be there. Relations have never been this bad, and it feels like Harry is just stringing it out to try and be difficult, frankly.